Hello friends, welcome to Excel Skill Corner. Topic of this video is advantage of table option over normal Excel sheet data. As a normal Excel spreadsheet data, there are certain disadvantages. Number one, in a large data, usually there will be a formula like sum total or average at the bottom. For example, we shall filter the data of each salesman to get his sales total. We can see that when we filter, we are not getting its sum total. Number 2. When we, sc when we scroll down, we cannot see the headers. These are some of the disadvantages. Now, let us convert this data to table data and see the advantages of it. To convert to table data, click on the table option in the insert app which will open a create table window. In the window, we can see that my table has headers option is checked. On clicking on OK, we can see a new tab called table design after the help tab. In table design, we can change the color of the table. The greatest advantage in table data is that without giving a filter option, it is automatically converted to filter mode. When we scroll down the table, we can see all the headers at the top without giving the freeze option. At the end, end of the table, let us take the sum. Now we will filter the data of a particular salesman. We can see the sum total here. Not only total, but we can get any type of calculation here. This is a very big advantage. Now we shall release the filter and sort it. Let us create a column with the formula. We will give commission as header for the adjacent column. In the first cell, type equal to and click on the amount cell. We can see that header has come as reference and then multiply with 0 0.05 and click enter. We can see the result not only in the first cell but in the whole column that too without dragging down the formula. At the bottom, we can see all the other calculations. So, this is a very easy option. Not only this, table data has a size smaller than the normal data. Another advantage is that we can insert slicers. Slicers are inserted by clicking on insert slicer option from the tool category in the table design tab. Slicers can be used to filter data according to our, according to our preference without using the usual filters. On clicking on salesman, a table of all the salesmen are created here and we can see the data relating to each one of them at the click of a button in the slicer. In the slicer tab, there are various options through which we can change the design, color, format, style, etc. of the data. In the table design tab, on clicking on export in external table data category, we can export the table to a SharePoint list. There are a variety of formatting options other than this in the table design tab. We can create a pivot table by clicking on the summarize with pivot table option in the tools category. This will summarize the data based on our preference. For example, we are selecting salesman and amount to get a summary of the amount of each salesman. Practicing table option saves our time 
and it is an easier option compared to the normal spreadsheet data. We can convert this back to normal data by clicking on Convert to Range in the Tools category of the Table Design tab. With that said, I am signing off. Let us meet again in a new video with a new topic.